Today's video is how to determine which tarot cards are applicable for the day. Um, the sun sign right now, it, today is January 3rd of 2015, and the sun sign is in Capricorn. So Capricorn would be the devil card, which I will show you right here. Um, and a lot of people have a lot of fear about this card, but we're going we're gonna to talk about it a little bit. And then today being the third, um, we go to the minor arcana. However, we have four suits of minor arcana. How, and how do we pick which suit to use, the pentacles or the swords or the cups or the wands? Well, Capricorn is in the earth element, and so we would pick the pentacles. So today is the three. So we do the Three of Pentacles. And here we have a mason in a cathedral with two monks looking up. It's a day about working together, physical work, and that's another um, element, or sign of Capricorn is hard work and labor. And um, Capricorn is ruled by Saturn. Saturn is the lord of winter. And of course today, January 3rd, we had a snow. So see the snow out there? So... Saturn is the Lord of Winter, who, by the way, is the enemy of the sun. Isn't that interesting? And according to um, Leonard Hor Horowitz, the number six means spiraling down from the heavens. And the devil card is 15, and one plus five is a six. So I thought, well, that was kind of interesting, a uh, little fact there. Um, so... The devil card talks about um, addictions and being trapped and lack of discipline. And because the pentacle that's um, in this horned being, which is the which is the goat figure, um, is pointing down, it means that the person is more concerned with the material world than they are of the spiritual. So there's an imbalance there. And one of the things that of the three of pentacles um, that is the working card so it would be a good day to do anything physical working and working with groups and that particularly you have a leader and so the leadership uh, finding someone who has knowledge if you have a question about what you're doing um, the devil card or capricorn only affects those people negatively who are not in um, who've lost their passion. They're not in connection with their life force and their, um, their zest for life and their willpower that, you know, because lack of discipline is lack of willpower. And so those people who are disciplined, um, they would use the positive side of the devil card, which would be hard work and working your way. You know, it, it's the goat, and goats like to climb to the top of the mountain. And so Capricorn is the energy of, of working your way up. So this is this really goes along with January New Year's Eve resolutions, where you're working to be a, a better part of yourself. That's what a resolution is all about. Um, it's interesting that... Um, the goat is, of course, Pan. Um, there's many theories about why the goat would be in the devil card. Um, so we, it, it goes to some religious and some pagan and druids. What I found interesting is that the druids on winter solstice, which is what we are right now, um, burned pine to draw back the sun because the sun was so important to their crops. And, of course, if you realize... The Christmas season, which is around the solstice, the we we have a pine tree, and we decorate it with lights to bring the light of the sun back. I thought that was very interesting, and also the fact that the pine cones are a phallic symbol of rebirth and immortality and eternity, and the Catholic Church has a huge pine cone. Um, at the Vatican right out in the courtyard so I thought that was interesting and then when we when we burn um, we put a wreath which is a pine you know a pine wreath on our doors which is a circle which symbolizes the Sun and we burn a Yule log which is a pine log to bring I mean there's when you look at all this pine connections and and allegedly the Christ birth is December they picked December it couldn't have actually been December but um, that we have these Christmas, which is pine trees. There's, you start to realize, really, I wonder why the devil card didn't have a pine tree in it. 
So all of these things are very interesting and you can research this more about the symbols of the tarot card and how they relate to all these things going on in our planet. But um, one of the things that is fascinating about the devil card is um, it does talk about a feeling of restriction which is also what the Saturn and Capricorn are about. So if you have any feelings of restrictions or being trapped then it's you would use the Sun card you could look at the Sun card which is light and happiness and everyone loves the spring of the year when the Sun is coming back to get yourself out of that but January 3rd is a powerful day to start new beginnings because you have the one of January and three is creativity it's a day to be uh, very creative and be hardworking thank you